What's up YouTube? How you guys doing today? Hope everybody's having a great day out there. Oh, let me tell you, this Ohio weather's driving me crazy. It was 78 yesterday, broke a record high, and now it's out there snowing. So, yeah, gotta love Ohio weather. Crazy. Makes me sick. Trying to get over this. Uh, I'm gonna try to get through this video without making any mistakes today. Hopefully, that'll work. But I'm only human, guys. So bear with me. Uh, today I've got the BAM box. And I've actually got the art upgrade box, which is pretty cool. So thank you to anybody and everybody that's used my referral codes for BAM. I really appreciate it. Uh, this is the 90s box. So super excited about this one. Um, next month I believe it's indestructible. So very cool. So. Without further ado, let's go ahead and bust in the BAM box. I do believe it's $26.99. Um, that's usually what it runs. So uh, I, I got like a year subscription, so I can't remember exactly what the monthly is on it. So definitely, I love this box. If you guys are into art prints, especially signed autograph things uh, of that nature, then BAM box is for you. If not, if you're more into the figure heavy type stuff, uh, I'm going to tell you right now then you're not looking in the right place with Bambox. Um, so just keep that in mind if you do decide to order a Bambox. I do love their prints. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I get the box is because of the very, very cool art prints. Um, so definitely cool to have an art upgrade box this time. So without enough rambling, let's bust into this box and see what we have this month. We got some black bar on top. We'll get rid of that. And we got pens. I actually got two pens. So, <laughs> these are BAM parody pens. Um, let's see, is that? Yeah, okay. Yeah, I got two of them. That's kind of weird. I've got like the Furby type pen. <laughs> crazy pen. Look at pink. Oh, crazy Furby pen. <laughs> That's interesting. Alright, and then I've got a Super Soaker. Which is so definitely, both of these are definitely a 90s, uh, 90s touch. That's for sure. Furbies and Super Soakers, those were definitely a 90s thing. Definitely. Alright, so first thing I'm going to pull out of here is a hockey puck that has been signed by Matt Daugherty who played Les Averman in the Mighty Ducks Okay, the Mighty Ducks. Oh, very cool. So let's pull this bad boy out of here. An actual hockey puck. Very cool. I know uh, my Canadian friends up north will definitely enjoy that. Because right on the side there it does. If you, I don't know if you guys can get a glimpse of that or not. But it does say Canada. Right on it. So, very cool. And here is the certificate of authenticity there. Very interesting item. Now, um, I, I did watch Mighty Ducks and I did like the movie, so that is an interesting item to put in a box. Very cool. I like it. Alright, let's see. What do we have next here? We've got something that is bostoncreativeproducts.com and it is a spoon. <laughs> Very cool. Um, <laughs> oh, what was that show? No soup for you. If you guys could see that without me getting a lot of freaking glare in there. It says no soup. No soup for you. <laughs> oh. I can't remember the name of the show offhand. And it's right off. I think it was Seinfeld or something like that. Yeah, I believe it was. Um, where they had the soup Nazi. I remember that. I remember that specific line from that. From that. Cause I didn't really watch the show much. But I remember it from the soup Nazi. Alright, so what do we got here in a little baggie? We have got something plushy, it looks like. We have got... Ha! 
Really? Okay. We've got a Beanie Baby. I've got a Koala. I have no idea why they said a specific Koala. Bikini, or, uh, named Mel. Its name is Mel, just so you guys know. Date of birth, January 15, 1996. How do you, well, okay, how do you name a koala bear? It's rather tough, I do declare. It confuses me. I got into a funk. I'll name him Mel after my favorite hunk. <laughs> oh, if you guys remember the Beanie Baby fad back in the 90s, it was stupidly insane. I, uh, I did collect a few. However, I sold them all as I got out of that era of Beanie Babies, which everybody knows nowadays that they ain't worth nothing. Aren't worth a dime anymore, but they are fun. They're funny to look at. Alright, so I got a koala. Don't know why. Hey, I got two more pens in here. So, I got, looks like I got all four pens this month. Uh, which is pretty cool. I have, looks like Nike High Top Sneakers. Da -da -da, the variant colored one and the regular colored one. So that's very cool that I got all four pens. Maybe that has to do with the art upgrade. Alright, so we've got a something in a tube here. With a certificate of authenticity. Uh, uh. Looks like it's a couple, couple uh, prints here. Wonder if they're like 11 by 17s. Oh, we've got the Bayside Brawl, right? <laughs> AC Slater and Zach Norris. It looks like it's signed by Zach Norris. That is interesting. That's about an 11 by 17 photo. Celebrity fight match. Oh, I got three of them here. Hold on guys. All right, so Wow, there's a lot. All right, and then I've got Let's see showdown in cyberspace The machine against the man. So we got agent Smith versus Neo on this one Very interesting and last but not least, we have Dr. Evil vs. Austin Powers. And uh, the signatures are all the same on this, so I'm guessing it's kind of like the artist uh, signature. So, Celebrity Deathmatch Fight. Yeah, this is this. Yeah, so these are have to be like uh, signed by like whoever did these. <laughs> Pretty interesting. These are pretty neat. I like them. Uh, alrighty. So, let's find out since we've got the 90s theme box here. Let's find out what is exactly. So, we got the BAM Parody Pens 90s edition, 90s edition. We have the Super Soaker, the Furby, and then the limited edition sneaker ones. Which I did get all four pens, which were really cool. Um, we got the Beanie Baby, uh, I got the Koala, I guess, uh, other people probably got different ones. <laughs> the Beanie Baby. Definitely 90s. They definitely stuck with the theme pretty good on this. Uh, we got the official size hockey puck signed by Matt Daugherty who played Les Averman on the Mighty Ducks. Which I think that's a very good nod to my Canadian friends there. To get a hockey puck sign. I know they will like that. Um, we got the Celebrity Fight Match 11 by 17 posters. These are battles we either wanted to see or love matching. Now you have an exclusive piece of what could have been. There are three different posters. The Preppy versus Dimples. The One versus the Wannabe. And the International Man of Mystery versus the Evil Scientist. All are numbered inside by the Creator. Josh Lamont, so that's why they're uh, they're all signed by Josh Lamont, the creator of those. That is that's pretty cool. Then we got the No Soup for You custom soup spoon. You're pushing your luck, little lady. Yes, I remember that episode 
of uh, the soup Nazi from Seinfeld. <laughs> so, yes, that was a good one. Alrighty, so that is it for the 90s fan box, guys. What did you think down below? Let me know. I did, uh, next month's theme is Indestructible. So if you guys are interested in next month's band box, I will leave a link down below. Make sure you hit that up. Helps me out a little bit. Gets you about $5 off your first band box. So definitely hit that up. And uh, let me know what you guys thought. I thought it was pretty neat to get some of the items. Uh, the spoon was unusual. Uh, the Beanie Baby, what can you say about that? The signed hockey puck and the pens were really cool. The 11 by 17 posters, they're interesting. Definitely. So, but let me know what you guys think. Um, and I'll see you guys real soon. Make sure you guys hit up my social media sites. And I'll see you guys later. Have a good night. Bye-bye.